Hello YouTube, this is Gamma Master 101 bringing you another video on Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. What I'm going to bring up is uh, what I think will be the best starting class, which is all around going to get you the kills, be able to support your team, and roll however you like. And so, let's start off. The primary weapon of this class is the M4A1 Carbine. The M4A1 uh, is the kind of all-around assault rifle. It's not too good at anything, but yet it's not too bad at anything. So you can use it in every situation, from the one-on-one -on -one assault to the team supporting guys. So it's kind of the all-around gun. Maybe that's the reason why it's not so popular. It's not po unpopular like in the other Call of Duty games because it's a bad gun. It's just the fact that it's definitely not an extreme gun. Like there's no like high power, low recoil, high power, low recoil, uh, slow rate of fire, low mag like the Scar, and it's not a uh, laser like the ACR, which is also kind of weak. Um, what this weapon is is it's that middle ground of the assault rifles. It's the it has all the pros, but like it has kind of halfway to the pros. So it has like you no, know, yeah, it's kind of what I was saying earlier. What I was going to put on it is the red dot sight. The red dot sight allows you to get a better picture of an enemy far away. This will be useful because of the weapon's generally low recoil, as I've seen in videos. Um, but it, it, in those long ranges where you could possibly get a kill, a red dot will definitely help. Um, the proficiency I was going to go with is range, so it increased that maximum damage. Uh, so maybe you might need one more shot to down a guy, but he's out of your maximum range damage, so it, it, it would take that one bullet, so therefore you don't get the kill. But with range, it increases how much damage you do during that range, and so you can get that kill without uh, fear of letting it, of it get in the way. Um, secondary, I was going to pop on a USP uh, with uh, whatever attachment. I have really no idea what the best pistol attachments are. Um, fast switch weapon, so really if you need it, just pop it out really fast and you're able to quickly get in, fire a few shots, bang bang bang, and take out the opponent. For perks, I was going to roll with sleight of hand, uh, quick draw, and steady aim. Sleight of hand makes you reload faster like in the other Call of Duty game, and sleight of hand pro makes it so that you uh, switch weapons faster. This will be really good because this gun has a decently high rate of fire, so you're going to have to switch mags often. And so that faster reload will leave you unprepared and unable un to defend yourself for shorter periods of time. Um, Slide of Hand Pro would also make the quick dry draw time of the pistol even shorter as it decreases the weapon switch time. Uh, quick Draw Pro allows you to aim down sights faster. Uh, no, quick, that's just regular Quick Draw, sorry. With quick Draw Pro allows you to throw grenades and stuff faster. Um, that'll be useful. Aim down sights, pop a guy, throw a grenade, back in the action in the flash. Steady aim, you get that faster hip fire, it's good stuff. Uh, steady aim pro, you're able to aim your sights faster after sprinting. So if you're caught off guard, boom, pull out your sights and peg the guy down. Uh, there's really no kill streaks you have to run with this class. I was geared towards more of the assault with the kill streaks. But like if I was going to support, I might run Blast Shield or Assassin in the red slot and Recon in the blue slot. But I wasn't going to do that. Um, so, yeah, that's all I have for this video. Uh, like if you liked it and please subscribe i need subscribers subscribers rule you guys are awesome bye